Hey guys, Aloha Mongoose here with a video that I, a live stream that I had to edit because um, half of the video my mic was off. Well, actually it wasn't off. I found out that the mic was like not connected properly. So I was talking to myself for like half of the video. So here I am doing, doing an edit on a live stream video. That's pretty sad, but it, it also comes to show you guys that I'm not really comfortable with live streams yet. And the setup and all that stuff um i'm still working on it it will get better but anyways the title kind of gives away what this video is all about we're searching for the abandoned volvo 242 that's around in need for speed payback um from what it's been saying it's around where the runner and the drift dealerships are so it's around in that area in between so um as you guys can see i'm kind of like figuring out what i have to do and now I'm kind of showing my car for all you Racing Rival subscribers and viewers out there. Um, I did a wrap on one of the Nissan Skyline turf cars that came out a long time ago. If you guys remember what it is or know about it, there you go. Anyways, I did my best on on the right side and then on the left side I kind of messed up. Um, I'm still fixing it, but um, yeah, it's a really nice wrap. It's one of my favorite wraps in me for... Um, racing rival so i just brought it to need for speed and um so right now i was like made a game plan where i was gonna go around the city around the highway and all that stuff but you know i didn't see anything on the highway before when i used to pass there so i was like you know what like i'm just gonna go and cut through right in that area and just like go around and all that um but yeah the abandoned cars and like the time limit that they give you is like it's a, it's a lot you know it's a lot of time to go and find the car and it gives you know people that don't play the game um you know don't play the game like daily and all that stuff some time to go and find out about it you know so that's why i want to follow need for speed on like you know instagram facebook and twitter and all that stuff so you can get notified about the next abandoned car coming out and any type of updates if you're still interested and curious about what the game has to offer you know um the last need for speed um game came out in 2015 they had some releases here and there on some cars and some events but after that they kind of just like it just faded out and it just came like really repetitive but i like how this game the game this game is where you got to go and find the abandoned car and when you find it you get chased by cops i don't know why cops are chasing you with an abandoned car maybe you have to pay for the ticket and all that stuff like hey you gotta pay for the ticket for that abandoned car i don't know how it is but um anyways i was thinking of a game plan i already like i was gonna go around on the left side but i ended up, ended up going on the right side so i was like ah you know what i'm just gonna keep going this way here um but yeah for all you guys um that watch my racing rivals videos and you guys are wondering when's my next racing rivals video it's coming up shortly i want to work on a live stream tutorial um i ran into that van on like i seen it coming i don't, I don't know why it took me so long to respond i had like a natural high moment right there anyways continuing i was deciding which way to go i was like should i go left should i go right what i'm gonna do and I was like, you know what? No, I'll just go in the residential area right here. So I ended up going that way. Um, but yeah, so stay tuned for that live stream uh, tutorial video and all that stuff. Uh, maybe I'll release it tomorrow on Thursday or Friday. Um, I'll see how my work schedule works out. You know, I'm trying to work my um, schedule around my job just because that's the most important thing to me right now. Because... Um, I'm getting paid for it you know and i have to pay for bills so um yeah there was a bait crate ended up passing it and then i get the nearby abandoned car notification and i was like oh okay so i ended up just following it following this um crowbar i think that's a crowbar i could be wrong um it's been a while since i worked on cars and remembered all the tools but there it is and um if you guys played through the whole game there was one a um runner event where you had to go pick up like suitcases or uh go to these um these um points where these cars had to beat up and i think you had to like pay somebody and all that stuff i think it was the one with uh i don't know he was doing some kind of cash run or whatever and paying people um but anyways we got the volvo not really comfortable about 
of the stock version the car turns really wide so i had to e-brake mostly the whole time to do those sharp turns car is very slow and i had like crown victorias chasing me at first and all that so i was like oh man these things are like a pain because this car is so slow you know but um yeah, I mean it's an abandoned car, a stock abandoned car. So you know, if the car was tuned up, why would it, why why would it be abandoned? You know. Anyways, yeah, I like how there's no checkpoints with um with this uh abandoned car. It was like really cool because I hate having to go through checkpoints because when I miss them, it you know it, it sucks. You know, but this is just kind of like oh, just make it back to the to the um to the airfield and you know if you go off track you go off track the gps is going to help you out there but the thing i didn't want it to do was get um busted by the cops um if you guys hear the wind i'm sorry i'm outside right now I'm trying to do this video just because i'm um it feels nice um it's a nice breeze coming through here and i just want to enjoy it <laughs> but anyways yeah this is a very, very long drive with all these cars chasing me and all that stuff. Um, but yeah, back to the Racing Rivals video. So I want to make that live stream tutorial. Um, I want to go through my uh, my free gold tokens um, since I didn't really um, go for the last um, go crates the last time. So there's that there. Um, so stay tuned for that and then I'm also trying to work on some tunes on my cars so I can do the next pink slip video for you guys um, But with that being said, I'm two miles away from the airfield. So um, Yeah And yeah, these cars were like really aggressive But I love the police chases in this game for need for speed payback because it's so action-packed and when when the police when you shut when you um when you shut down or destroy one of the um pr um pursuit cars they you know they have the slow motion crashing crashes and all that stuff it's so so nice you know it makes videos look a lot better you know rather than doing a drag race or a drift race and this charger just came out of nowhere yeah the charger like was super aggressive and it had the kill switch on so i was just like oh i gotta run away but right after the tunnel i noticed they started to fade away a little bit which was really nice whoa that rhino came out of nowhere i was here we go almost there almost there It was around here they started to fade away. Yep, there they go. They started to fade off. And I was like, okay, I'm almost there. Nice drive. All right, so we made it. We escaped the um the pursuit, the cops and all that stuff. So yes. I like how Rav kind of explains the car right after you bring it to the garage and all that stuff. That is really nice to know. You learn a little bit about the abandoned and the derelict cars in this game, which is really cool. Oh my god, it was off this whole entire time. That's embarrassing. I swear I turned, turned it on before I did this live stream. I don't like buttons, I need switches. Well... It looks like I'm gonna I'm still gonna upload this live stream and do a voiceover I guess. So you guys are just in the making of a video edit. I did not Jahomi, I did not know my if my mic was on or not. And it's so funny because I was telling people in the live stream like, oh guys, you guys can hear me and I was thinking to myself, well if my mic is off they won't be able to hear me anyway. Oh my goodness. See my um my headsets has buttons and not switches. I want switches so I can see that my mic is on and all that stuff. Oh my god, so my video was silent the whole entire time and I was talking to myself. That's why I wasn't getting views.
Yeah, see, I'm still learning this live stream thing. Did how many live streams already, and I still don't get it. Okay. Anyways, back to the video. No, it's a it's a race build. Actually, when you find the car abandoned, it's a it's a race it's a race build. Starts off at uh, level 166. It's the Volvo 242DL. Thank you for those who were sticking around the whole entire live stream while my mic was off. I did not know it was off. Because I turned it on. I turned on the live stream. And I was talking and I was wondering why I wasn't getting views. Now I know why. I wasn't talking. And I was like, in my mic, can you, can you guys hear me? Can you guys hear me? I think now you guys can hear me, because my mic is on. Anyways, yep, the abandoned car is the Volvo 242DL. Um, it's a race build. As said, there's the stats. Um, right now I'm going through editing, getting all that rust off. Um, no, we're not ready. Got those rusty wheels though. We gotta do something about that. So let's go. It's a race build, so let's put on some racing rims here. Let's go all the way to the end. Let's see what we got. Having feels for that one right there. Looks nice. Having feels for that one too. But then these rims are like so overused because of the the unicorn that was in the last game. Alrighty. Um maybe I can stay on for a couple more minutes before I have to go into work or get re ready to work. Which I kinda wanna chill with you guys. Play video games all day. But I gotta make that money. Um, let's put on something that we don't usually see. There are blue rims. Let me go through it again. Oh, the blue rims. This one. Okay. For sure. Boom. So sporty. Oh my god. Is that a sports car? Yeah, there we go. Yo, let's just keep that on. And see what we can work with from there. Of course, dance. Just that stance though. that back a little bit there you go and we take a little view of the car man those are some skinny tires look at that those are skinny okay one thing I didn't do was change the headlights to see our headlight options <gasps> oh the intake Headlights that is nice That's cool too But since we got some blue rims on there, let's make the blue headlights That starting to look pretty cool it's coming together Tint it up a bit Oh the tail lights I forgot we could change those Ah. Uh, Let's go for that smoke amount right there. There we go. Yeah, the intake headlights. Actually, you know what? Let's let's put those on. <laughs> I guess I can do that. 
I'm fine with that. Um, and there we are. We got the Volvo. And um, I guess I'll make a wrap and all that stuff for it. Later on. But yeah, guys, that concludes our video. We found the Volvo 242DL. Um, this video is going to be up as a live stream video and then I'm going to take it off and I'm going to edit it because in the beginning of my video it was really quiet because my mic was off so um sorry about that um yeah I know do it on both sides that will look sick um but yeah it looks like I have to go and take this live stream and edit do some editing to it um just to make it worth people's viewing and all that but I'm just gonna leave it up for now I'm gonna go to work and then when I get back from work that's when I'll do the editing anyways um with that being said thank you guys for sticking around tuning in make sure you subscribe if you want to see more things need for speed and racing rivals I will be making more racing rivals videos soon stay tuned for uh, a pinks video a crate opening video and I also have a um, tutorial video in the making um, but till then guys aloha see you guys in the lobbies see you on see you online multiplayer I'll be doing some speedlesses um, speedless racing on here and then that's it guys have a good day and good luck in your future races aloha